Let's quickly make a digital scrapbooking layout using an easy page from Cindy Knuckles 4x6 French Market Easy Page Pro album. First, I need to open my supply files. I'm going to browse to the folder where they are located on my desktop and find the easy page I want to use. Here it is. Once I open it, the easy page shows up in the photo bin below. That means it's available for use. Now I'll get the picture I want to use. Here's a picture of my grandson Raven. I'll open it. Again, it shows up in the photo bin at the bottom. Now that I have my files ready to go, I'll select the Move tool. It's the little cross at the top of my toolbar. I'm going to drag and drop the photo on top of my Easy page. I want to resize it so that it will fit in the opening of the Easy Page. I'll hold down my Shift key so that it resizes proportionately and then double click on it to accept the change. Now I'll go to the Layers palette. It's at the bottom right corner of the workspace. I'll make sure that the photo layer is highlighted. Then I'll move the photo layer below the Easy Page by dragging it down. Last, I'll slide the photo around a little bit so it's in the correct position. The next movie teaches you how to add text to your layout. Want to learn more? It's easy for you to learn all of the tips and tricks you need for making more complicated pages, your own supplies, to edit your photos, and more through the complete tutorial series named Scrapbook Software Secrets Revealed. It's available for Photoshop Elements, Photoshop and PaintShop Pro in the ScrapRolls.com boutique.